Hello everyone, this is Luxury PL38. Today's unboxing was actually the one that I purchased a few days ago and um, just before the price increase. But um, apparently there wasn't much of an increase here in Canada and there is no increase in the United States. So that was actually a good thing for us over here. But unfortunately, there's quite a big of an increase in Australia where the currency is actually at very weak at the moment and that's the reasons why the increase are different in different parts of the country because of the foreign currency or the currency rates the weaker currency rates in that country will have an increase or even a higher increase for the Chanel style and that's the item that I purchased last week it's actually a coin purse and let me just show you what the inside is. I'm also going to do a comparison with the larger point purse that I've got. It's more like a cosmetic pouch that is made in Spain. And this was actually the two nice series and I was surprised when I saw this because it was the 20, I think 2020 collections. If I'm not mistaken, it was the 20K collections. And the thing is, there is no authenticity card. So when I purchased this, there is no authenticity card. And I have to go back to the boutique and apparently they're still looking for it. But um, the manager mentioned that they're not supposed to sell any items without the authenticity card. So it is a misstep or the unfortunate negligence of the SA that sold me this particular item because she's not supposed to sell it without the authenticity card. But from the receipt itself, it is from the 20K collections and I was surprised that they still have items which was two years ago. I do apologize, I've just checked the receipt. It is from the 20S collections. So that's exactly two years ago because we're now on the 22S collections that's launching next week. And this is in the color dark pink in Caviar with gold hardware. So I absolutely love this. It is just so adorable. It is priced at 605 Canadian dollars. And um, this is the larger size, which is more like a cosmetic pouch that I've got. So just comparison purposes. And for someone that is curious with the card holder, because this is technically a coin purse and this is more like a card holder, although they do say it is like a coin purse as well, but you can definitely fit your card here. So in terms of comparison wise, and you are able to fit your card in here. Let me just show you later on. The height is definitely taller on this. And it is thicker as well. And um, obviously the length is not as long as the card holder. But yes, you can fit a card in there. Okay, so a card, a credit card or a driver license, it's actually the same dimensions as the authenticity card and you can fit it in but you have to tilt it just a little bit. See, that's how you fit it in. And basically you fit it in from the top here to diagonally to the bottom bits on the other end or vice versa. But yes, you are able to put in a few cuts. I was able to put in around five cuts here and I can put in a little bit of items just on the front and at the back. But um, I would love to actually keep this. It's just that there is no authenticity cut. So I'm still thinking if I should keep it or not. Technically, Chanel are not supposed to sell items without the authenticity cut so that's what the managers say and they are trying to find it in the boutique hopefully they'll be able to find it it's probably just misplaced somewhere but I would love to keep this and um, the price is reasonable it's 605 Canadian dollars and once again thank you so much for watching if you do have any questions or comments please do so in the sections below